This is Hydrogen Tap 1 Series 3. What we're doing here is showing a follow-up video of the last test we conducted on the 5.5 inch plates in a 3.5 inch 2 As you can see, the reason for this follow-up is because of the missing discoloration of the water. The water is clear. The last test was conducted using plain tap water and running on the same 12-volt battery supply. The amperage that was used here was approximately 15 amps. What we're doing in this video is a follow-up a complete check after the last test. Right now we're looking straight down the tube. As you can see the water is clear. What you're looking at are some of the hydrogen bubbles still left on the plates. I have no idea why this has happened. We're using the same tap water from the same spigot, same pipes, same plates. Any and all theories that anyone might have, I would appreciate. Again, this is the second half of the last test. What we're doing is checking over the plates after the hydrogen bubbles have d dissipated in the air. The water is completely clear. I cannot see any trace of any discoloration. And we're using the same wire in there, which if that problem occurs because of the wire, it should be here now, and it is not. The next test we're going to have is with that tube that you're looking at there closed. And we will check to see how much hydrogen is being generated by this configuration. It is my guess that we're going to see at 15 amps the same amount of hydrogen will be produced that we were getting at 30 amps. One of the reasons for the last test was to see whether we could operate at 15 amps in a system this close or closed. The amount of temperature in that water when it was operating was around 80 degrees. As you can see, there's not anything in that water. The water is clear.